Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the IREP International Documentary Film Festival. Today is the last day and 30 documentary films were screened during the course of this festival. As you already know, the essence of this film festival is to celebrate and encourage documentary film makers in Nigeria and across Africa. I'm going to be speaking with some of the filmmakers and they are going to be sharing their experience as well as most memorable moments during the course of this film festival. My name is Ahine Atel and this is Afrorevel TV. I'll be right back. So how was your film festival experience, your IREP film festival experience? I think IREP for me is an amazing platform because it enables storytellers to be able to tell their stories, at least uh, put it forth to the public to see and become the, and make their decisions about what the films are all about and maybe in terms of technicalities and maybe storylines and they said right you know so for me it's an amazing platform and kudos to the guys who started the festival jaman femi and every other person yeah i must say it's an amazing one that i have to say a very 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 big thank you to femi jaman marking Irep for providing this platform and very interestingly enough, Some. there's another lady here, Obama, who has to be given her due credit for providing a platform for indigenous filmmakers. So tell us about this Oja, your inspiration and everything. We want to know the brain behind that inspiring non-fictional film we just witnessed. Okay, that means you want a very condensed message because the film was about 40 minutes and indeed it couldn't capture everything yes. about the other. Mm -hmm. Well, the instrument is interesting. It's a speech surrogate instrument. It's one of the most prominent instruments in the Igbo culture. Oh. Every Igbo person identifies with it. And it's one of the most popular indigenous instruments in, no in Nollywood. Mm -hmm. You get to hear whatever it's if it's an epic movie, you likely mm -hmm. hear the other. Mm -hmm. So the bottom line is that for the youth in the house, to get to the archives, you need to just be interested. You will get what you want. Thank you very much. What is the difference between how um, the documentary is done outside the country in the UK, where you came from, and how it's done in Nigeria? Well, um, I'd say that you have much more opportunities um, for creativity and content creation okay. um, in England where I've practiced in, in um, recent times. Mm -hmm. So you, you have more funding, there's a lot more appreciation for it and um, documentary enthusiasts are all up in your face, you know they are mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. In Nigeria we have them but they're not all up in your face so you're a bit uncertain as to oh are people going to watch this mm -hmm. you know if I make this but um, there is, there is um, a teaming and building group of documentary enthusiasts mm -hmm. in Nigeria. Mm -hmm. um, but it, we lack a lot of funding you know, for content creation in Nigeria. Um, there's lack of training as well. So you have people who are interested in telling stories and who have really important stories and beautiful stories to tell, mm -hmm. but they're not trained enough to produce something of good standard that can compete both locally and internationally. Guys, I have me Chigezie and he's a documentary filmmaker. Chigezie, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Thank you. Now yeah. I want to ask you this. Why documentary as a filmmaker? Uh, documentary is important because it's, um, it's one of those um, vehicles uh, in the, with which you can use to address a lot of issues in the society. I think it's, uh, it's necessary because it, it, it can be used to change the narratives, especially narratives that don't suit us. Mm -hmm. So um, it's, 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 it's very important. It's filmmaking. But it's a it's a kind of filmmaking where the issues are are, are, are very well laid out, mm -hmm. you know, uh, with, with pictures and the interviews and with most importantly researches. Mm. 